Good afternoon. That's Dan Horton, Horton's Lawn and Garden. I'm sitting out here in the greenhouse, starting seeds for our 2021 20, season. It's uh, December the 17th. We buy a lot of our seeds off of eBay, and we're having a hard time getting them due to this COVID. And I'm sitting here thinking of all the people that have lost loved ones and friends due to this COVID. My mother is currently in the hospital right now with the COVID. You know, I, I have said all summer long that, you know, a lot of small businesses are hurting due to, due to it. Uh, unfortunately, ours was not one of them. Uh, our greenhouse has picked up quite a bit. Uh, you know, one weekend we had the, the whole parking lot full, clear over into our personal driveway of people that was picking up that had bought stuff offline from us. And we just meet them in the parking lot and they pick up their items. Uh, we couldn't keep stock. Uh, everything that we planted on our own was gone probably by the first or second week of April. But this is a nasty disease, folks. You know, I'm not an expert on it. I'm just feeling a little bad right now because usually I have my mother out here with me in the greenhouse helping me plant and being my gopher and getting things for me and I don't have her with me and I'm I guess I'm just feeling a little down in the dumps thinking you know I, I don't know what tomorrow is going to bring none of us do so prayers go out to everyone that, that that's in similar situation as me and I hope everything goes well I hope 2021 is a, a lot uh a lot better for all of us. Uh, if there's any kind of a video that anybody would like to see due to the lawn care, like I said, we currently have a, I guess I should tell you a little bit about our business. We have a, we started out about 29 years ago just strictly mowing grass. Now after we mowed grass for a little while I started working on my own equipment. Next thing you know I have a shop working on other people's equipment. Then about oh, 15 years ago I started selling plants uh, from another vendor out of state and let's see I think it was five years ago I put up my first greenhouse which none of my greenhouses are actually greenhouses they are tents uh, a lot of these tents have bad reviews online uh, out of the three that I have one of them I would not recommend buying uh, I'm currently in what I call my lean-to which is a uh, 12 by 21 I just put up this year which is uh, more of a controlled environment to start seeds in I'll flip it around here it has a polycarbonated roof it has a big max 50,000 foot 50,000 BTU heater and then the walls are lined in six mil plastic um, right now uh, the temperatures got down to about 28 in here or 28 on the outside last night on the inside with this big max heater it was roughing running roughly uh, we had the temperature set at 70 degrees the furnace was kicking in and off so I know it was getting the room up to temperature um, on the other end of this uh, 20 foot I have one of these tents hooked up which you can see here I have this one blocked off I currently am not running a heater in this one uh, I'll probably stick a LB White uh, heater in or a Mr. Heater wall heater. Um, the only heat that this building has in it right now is uh, the runoff off of the 50,000. We got a little vent cut there with a, a wall fan in it, and it is currently 60 degrees in this room. Uh, at night, it's been dipping down to roughly, roughly uh, 50 55 in this one. This one is made by Delta uh, Tent and Awning. It's a 40-footer. Uh, I've noticed that it doesn't seem to move and give as much as my 30-footer does that I have. Uh, I put a 33 in about five years ago. It still has its original plastic on it. The only bad part was where the doors are. There were some bad zippers. So I had to put solid walls in those. Uh, I also bought a 26-footer from... Uh, I believe it was a company, Sunny, Sunny something. 
Uh, I'll look that up and I'll post post that later on what it actually is. I would not recommend buying one of those due to the fact that it didn't last a year with the plastic before it broke, broke off. Um, but uh, if there's anything else, like I say, if there's anything else that you guys would like a video on pertaining to lawn care or lawn maintenance or uh, repairing the mowers, let me know and I'll try to get something posted. And then again, I'd like to get prayers to everybody for the 2020 of the bad year. I hope everybody's 2021 looks better. And uh, I will maybe post some videos a little more often now that you know I'm in the greenhouse sitting around doing anything. So, or the shop uh, getting our mowers ready for spring, which is what our next uh, two months are going to be like. So, if there's something particular you'd like to see, Shoot it in the comments. Let me know what you got, what you want to see. Uh, you guys have a good day.